Good evening everybody from the Las Vegas Strip. It's January 1st, 2024. Happy, Happy New, New Year. Year. Happy New Year. <laughs> um, to all our followers, subscribers, anyone that's even stumbled across this vlog, Happy New Year to you and welcome. My name's Chris. I'm Jolene and we're Hangovers and Hampays. We're a daily travel vlog channel. Um, and this week our vlogs are coming to you from fabulous Las Vegas. Yes, our favorite place in the world. So over this next week, we're gonna try and cram in as much casinos, hotels, restaurants, maybe the odd show, gambling. And definitely a lot of slots. A lot of slots, yeah. And hopefully, get that hand pay. Hopefully, the elusive <laughs> hand pay, yes. Hopefully, everyone seems to be getting hand pays in a minute, so it'll be nice for us to get one, but. Yes, I agree. Yeah, let, so, let's go. welcome back. Let's go get this party started. Yes, let's go. And this is the status of Old Red, uh, Jolene's favourite bar she's never been to. <laughs> <laughs> well, Blake Shelton owns it, so it's bound to be right up my street. Yeah. But I'm just saying to Chris, there's no way that's going to be open this month. No like chance. It's, it's yeah, it was meant to be January, but yeah. yeah I don't I know. I noticed that they're selling tickets for a Super Bowl package, so maybe they'll be open. Yeah, it'll be open February then. Well, we'll do everything to, to get that. So Jolene says she's taking me to a bar where there's $5 beers. So I'm like, yeah, lead the way. This is one of my favorite times of the holiday. It's the first drink, what are you gonna buy? It's the inaugural, what drink yeah. are you gonna buy? So excited. She was right, $5 white claws. What's the beers? Uh, five price. bucks? Yeah, five bucks. Yeah. Hmm, what to get? All right, Jolene. So we, if Chris had to pick what I was gonna get, mm -hmm. he'd say I was gonna get a Mike's. Yeah, you were gonna get a Mike's harder lemonade, yeah. Just to throw a thing in the mix, I am gonna get a big wave. Oh, a Kona big wave. <laughs> Yeah, there's a big wave for everyone on New Year's Day, I'm sure they're all so happy. Um, yeah, they, that was, that's really nice, we had that last time, last year, yeah, I love that. Oh, last year, 2023. I'm going for the hazy little thing IPA. I want to be hit hard, put in the spots, first drink, that's what I want. Well, if you're quick, I'll even pay for it for you. How about that? Yeah, sure. <laughs> so there was me thinking Jolene was bringing me to a bar, but it was actually a souvenir store. But hey, she was right. Five dollar beers. I'm sure they're cheaper somewhere else, but hey, we don't care. There is nothing like that first night Las Vegas energy, is there? And we haven't seen the fountains in ages, and just coincidentally, they just started as yeah, we were walking by we're here. we're walking up here. Amazing. You know, it doesn't matter how long a travel day you've had or how tired you feel when you get out of the hotel. It's just, it's just an energy that flows through your veins. It just, you feed off it. You know, you just wake straight up when you crack that beer open and you head to the casino. So we're heading over to the Cosmo because we have something we have to do there. Hold that door. been following the channel for a while you'll know that on our social media streams we did some polls this time before we came away uh, for a new segment that we're calling you say we try so the first poll was for which speakeasy we should try and find and try and let you know what we think of and the winner was ghost donkey 
So if you're looking to find where Ghost Donkey is, you come to the district beside Holstein's in the Cosmo and it's just straight down by Hattie Bay's over here and it's like where that far exit sign is, that's actually the door. So let's go see what it's like. All right, well that didn't really go to plan, did it, Jolie? No, and we really did try our best for you tonight, but yeah. we'll be back here. It's actually closed. Even though it says it's open till 12, yeah. it's only um, like 25 to? Yeah, um, it's like half 11, we'll get in there for a drink. Um, and then just literally the food courts pull the ropes pull across. the ropes across and like, no, no, Ghost Donkey's closed yeah. now. So we will come back with another couple of times that we're up here during the yeah. trip. So we'll definitely get back and try out Ghost Donkey. Yeah. And if nothing else, we'll show you where it is. Yeah, there you go. So we did try, so uh, all else fails. Let's go, to go back casino. to the spot. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Okay, so after the ghost donkey debacle, we are going <laughs> we are going to the Aria to play some slots. We were gonna play slots in the Cosmo, but it was just so busy. Yeah. So there was like queues for most of the slots. Yeah, it was like hit the MGM card straight away. But this is a bit of deja vu. Because the last year we came here, went to the Aria the first night, but them's the breaks, people. <laughs> Alright, that's the Aria there. Um we we're meant to be going there, weren't we, Jolie? We still are. We've taken a detour because I'm an alcoholic and a bit of a piss head. And I just remembered what happened this last year where we didn't get any drinks from the cocktail. For over an hour, yes. Yeah. So we're going to go to the Walgreens or CVS, whatever it is here at the side. Yeah. And get some beverages. Yeah, let's go. Jolene's looking melatonin. Helps her sleep, apparently. Well, I forgot mine. Didn't I? Yeah, you did. Costly mistake. $13.49. <laughs> anyway, two rounds for the magazine right here. Alright, we're in Aria. Finally time for the slots. Finally. Seems like they've been teasing me all night and it's running about the shops and ghost donkeys that aren't open and you know. But yeah, let's get something going here. Oh hi, I've missed you Trevor. Yeah, it seems fitting it has to be Trevor. He was so good to us in the last trip. So that means, yeah, that means he's going to be really bad to us this trip. That's generally the way it goes, isn't it? All right, good old Trevor. We're going to start on five cent and um, and three dollars to spend. Is it three dollars? Yeah. Yep. Let's go. <laughs> Come on. The graphics look so old now, don't they? Oh, there he is. Throwing his balls. Oh, I like that. Keep that up, Trevor. A bit more, please. All right. We just hit the bonus. On the three dollars a spin, five cent an arm. We were toying with drawing it there. We were down to like thirty something dollars. But yeah, I said no. I know show him a bit of love. Jolene said, and you were right. You were right to be honest. Yeah. So yeah, talks to start. Let's go. Jolene loves monkeys, eh? Who knew? Come on. I'll take the fire length. I'll take an explosion. Super far length, stop, 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 no, not free games, no, 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 no. Oh, no way. Well, let's see what happens. Oh, we collect them. Oh, he collect them, I didn't know that. Yeah, very rarely get free games, like when he got it once the last yeah. time we are here. Five, five spins, only five so. spins, yeah. Come on, come on. Something nice. Now this is five cent. So that's, yeah, it's 55, 57 bucks. Sorry. Getting too excited, Julian. <laughs> come on. Something big. Come 
one, last one, last one. Say that's um, money back. I said, but probably is roughly about the hundred bucks back, isn't it? Press the button. Yeah, the book. Well, yeah, there we go. Profit. Yeah, thirteen dollars <laughs> twenty-five in profit. Here's Trevor. Oh yeah, good old Trevor. Okay, well left Trevor. Uh, Kai started just under a hundred bucks, and we're coming to Fruday, Lian, Lian, Panda. Yeah, uh, what do we do? Two cent. And what are they? Yeah, so 88 is 176. 176. There we go. Let's give this a go. Yeah, a little one there to start. Okay, the prosperity has just triggered for us. Um, about 40, 40 bucks in, but with a lot of two and three dollar wins there. But then, yeah, yeah, like yeah. All right, so let's go. Oh, you're lucky, you're look at all them pandas. Oh, so it's st still putting coins in that. Trigger. Yeah, you want the jackpot, yeah. Come on. 484 win, do you have to press it? Yeah. Oh shit. Sorry. 674. There you go. Well, I don't know. I think it goes itself, but yeah, there we go. It does see itself. Come on, trigger again. See the way that's still full. Does that mean it can trigger again or re-trigger? Or... I don't know. It's strange, but 742 is not much of a win. You know, there's only two spins left. Come on, longevity. Yeah, pretty per bonus the minute. Is that it? Yeah. Oh wow, 942 bonus. That, that, well, it's the same makers as Buffalo, <laughs> so I think there's a clue. Because to be honest, 942 is very good for a Buffalo bonus, <laughs> even for like 24 spins in a Buffalo. Well, one set, well, well, 176, bet. you know, but you know, but, you, no, but that's the minimum bet on a two set. I know, but you still expect, I don't know, 30, yeah. 30, 40 dollars maybe in that, but anyway, keep uh, there we go, yeah. Alright, we cashed out 50 bucks. So we're going to look for another machine. Jolene's pick. Jolene picked Trevor. I picked whatever the hell that Luan Leon machine, whatever it was. So Jolene's pick now. Alright, Jolene has picked the hot stuff wicked wheel smoking. So she'd also like this machine. I like this machine to be honest, so. I'm not complaining about this. Let's go. All right, we finally triggered the bonus. So, so hopefully we can hit something. Let's go. Yeah. And you can hear us over Alibi, which is blasting. Oh, and he's removed Penny already. Penny removed in the Woo. first touch. Well done, Jolene. <laughs> Jolene, you pick everything. Uh, no, because I hate having all the responsibility. Uh, you're you're going you're gonna to be epic. I'm going to be epic. Oh, epic. Epic, there you go. <laughs> Epic. epic, two epics, two megas, come on. That's come happening on. to somebody, come on. Yeah, it has to go to oh, somebody. Minor, so go oh, away, minor. Come on. Grand, ultra, minor. No. Oh. 20 bucks. 20 bucks, is that all? Oh, wait, wait. No. Major? Come on, the major. Well, it's 33 bucks. Oh, yeah, no, but that's good. Yeah, don't get too excited, but yeah, it's not bad. All right, all right. Hold on to your hats because we're having losing know. before this. So, no, you know. no. You think a major pay for more than 33 bucks? But anyway. It's not lightning like me. No, I know. You get to watch them dance, so you can't hear them. Like, but anyway. Yeah, I think we're going to move a bit further away from Alibi. Or actually, I think it's Lift Bar. It is Lift Bar. Lift Bar, yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. nuts. Okay, we're gonna play this new game. Well, I've never seen it before. Triple coin treasure, and that like that's got bars of gold and everything in it. So it looks like it's gonna win. We all know Chris is always drawn to the big pots, and nothing ever happens for him. No, that's true. <laughs> and we're going two bucks to spin, five cents at all. 
Come on, Jolene. Oh, sorry. Forgot it was my go. Oh, oh. right, right, okay. Oh, look, he jumped up. <laughs> oh, yeah, and then winked at you. Yeah, you're not getting anything, but I'll just wink at you. <laughs> Come on. Come on, give us something. Oh, when you see the blue one, the grow rails, you're like, oh, please. Oh, there he is. He's got a diamond. Nice. Oh, he's playing around there, isn't he? <laughs> Needs to pay out. <laughs> okay, Chris. So, I don't know about the luck of the Irish, but this machine's been pants. They never worked for me. No, the the, the, we've never, never won on a leprechaun never. machine. I have no idea why you picked this one. Never. Um, well, it was the pots. We got, we got the red one. After that, but you know, yeah. Told you, Chris loves a big pot. I do, it never works. <laughs> okay, I know why we're not winning, and we're pretty much down tonight. Because I committed the cardinal sin of not rubbing the Buddha's belly. Bring me fortune. Okay, Jolene's come over to Dancing Rums for birthday, which I will never complain about her pick. So, you pick, you get to sit down, but. Jolene is very happy at the minute because <laughs> she met one of her favourite bloggers Aww. literally round the corner. I'm not going to film her, of no, course. No, no, we're not going to film her, but um, the lovely Claire from Team Claire Vlogs is just around the corner and she's such a fab lady. She's really, really nice. There you go. So yeah. I, I, that has made Jolene's night. Yeah. <laughs> Close the pot. Yep. 54 bucks. Nice. 54 bucks and closing the pot. Very nice. The drum just went boom, boom and extend the rails. Happy days. Good, good. I was getting to worry about Aria there because we're getting close to being down about 150 bucks. But yeah, it's giving us a game. There's a lot of things that we just drained our money. So let's go. You know what you're going to pick. Well, we're going to get the mini. Hopefully not. <laughs> I'm picking for a change. Oh, you pick. I'm going to pick, and this is really hard. I'm holding the camera. So I have to do both. <laughs> just look at the screen. Ah, but then my camera will be off. Oh, blue. It's not a Minor. Oh, that was quick. <laughs> yeah, that's very quick. All right. Yeah, I'll take that. You know, 55, there you go. 77 bucks. I'll go, we'll take that. We'll take that. Good old dancing drums again, eh? Love it. Always bails you out. Cheers. Cheers, people. It's not the 2nd of January, by the way. <laughs> We're letting this play because we haven't seen too many of these no, points yet. No, there hasn't, no. Bonuses of eight bucks and everything, you know. Come on. This is where Jolene watches vlogs in the house. It goes, hit the skip button, hit the skip button. <laughs> That's just letting this play. Isn't it interesting? Yeah. Alright, okay, I'll press it. Oh, yeah, I'll, I'll press it when I have ten bucks left to count. Yeah, fair enough. At least you pressed it, eh? <laughs> Okay, we cashed out of 50 bucks on dancing drums. We're up to 113 or something. So we're down about 100 here. Um, we're gonna play Crazy Rich Asians, which I've never played before, but I've seen so many people win at this and get a good game at it. So I actually wanted to play the new um, Plan of Moolah, but I couldn't find it, even though I did see it earlier, but there we go. Okay, so that um, $3 to spend Crazy Rich Asians went very, very quickly. I could've told them that was gonna happen. Yeah, but I thought it gave us a game. It would, sorry, it would. No, it didn't even give us a game. No line hits. Absolutely no. A couple of spins and that was it. Boom, 50 quid. Gone. Yeah, yeah. Well, but we're on 50. Dancing Drums Explosion, this big jam one. I'm just happy because it's a double seater. And we don't have to substitute ourselves in for a seat. You know, so. Yeah, we're going to uh, throw 50 bucks in this. See anyway, to rest your laurels, eh? Uh, indeed, yes. <laughs> I need food. Um, yeah, so we got we got a win there, and then Jolene cheered. What are you cheering for? It's six bucks. Is the pot it closed? I can't keep me on all that. We literally honest. had to put an extra five dollars in to seven dollars. Seven dollars to get this yeah. bonus. So that's fifty-seven dollars in total, honey. Fifty-seven dollars. Yeah. So yeah, let's see. Oh, let's and we actually hit a line hit just before. Yeah, this. like thirty-two bucks. Thirty-two yeah, bucks. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. All I'm, right, Jolene, you pick. I'm picking this time. Okay. Jolene's now gone from the jewel. Mirror, what is that? Gold. 
What's the gold? Brown? Well, we want the gold. I don't know. Whatever it gives me, it gives me. I don't know. I'll take the blue one because <laughs> the blue one's 25 bucks. Oh, oh it's typical. a mini. <laughs> 13, 40, you know what. Here, it's you know giving what? us a game. Well, it wasn't for a while. I know. But... Took out an extra seven bucks. So it's, yeah, it's lovely. So. Trulies are strong people. Yeah. <laughs> Seems everything when you've an empty stomach. Alright, we just hit another $32 line hit. But it's one thing we haven't said, and we've been in here for well over an hour. Oh, uh, no, more. Like, it's half one. Yeah. Um, like we've been in here from like well before like 12? Well, no, 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 no. 12 o'clock probably, just about 12 o'clock. Uh, yeah. um, not a drink, so how glad yeah. am I that I yeah. said to Chris, no, let's go to CVS and get our carry out just not in one, case. Not one drink offer. All night. Uh, we've, seen, we've seen one waitress all night yeah. and she never offered us a drink. No. So I don't know whether that's because we have a ton of beer, but... I don't know, it, it, it seems to be getting really, the cocktail service getting a lot worse in Vegas, it really does. At least in the area. No, 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 you're just here. Yeah. Like, calm your knickers, you know, calm last, last year, it was an hour before we got a drink, you know, and then, you know, that's why you go to, just go to CBS and buy a couple of beers, bring them in. Yeah, you know, goes, like, yes, like, we've had a great evening. Yeah. I don't care that we haven't been offered a, a, a drink because... It makes no difference, there's still plenty of beer left, yeah. you know. Yeah. Uh, when I when I finish my beer, I might be a bit cranky. But, um, no, I think that's more hangry. You've mentioned a couple of times now you're a bit starved. Yeah, because I don't really eat airplane food, so I was trying to avoid it. The last thing I had was like a toasty. Cheese it was, toasty. It was a bit grim. Yeah, and that was at about, I don't know, 10 hours ago. So yeah, yeah. I'm feeling a bit, uh, I need food, yeah. Uh, if we were in El Cortez, I would have uh, shoved three hot dogs down my throat right now. <laughs> But we're not, we're in Aria and no, 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 I don't that's even know where to go. Week. That's for later in the week. Hey, hey, I, I, that's, for, that's for the only phones. <laughs> if you've ever seen a place where you'll win money, it's got to be here. Look at the state of that. This it's got to be. Look, yeah. look the camera in there. Look. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah. I might drink that. <laughs> So we literally just run about $70 through this because Chris added more and all we've ended up doing is adding to the carnage with my drink. <laughs> That's it. Uh-oh. All right, Mr. Cashman Bingo. Jolene couldn't resist walking past. Only because our first trip that yeah. we ever vlogged, I, I got I got a really good win on this machine and I was like, let's yeah. play him, and let's play him. Because I said, you know, 375 is looking good, you know, it's quite close. So put a wee bit in, we put like 15 bucks in. Yeah. Then Jolene threw another 20 and why not? And then look at this. We've got the free spins, let's go. It's gotta be good, 375 a bet. Come on, let's go. Come on, give us that bingo. Please give us a bingo, please! <laughs> yeah, zoom out a little bit there. Come on! Want that bingo? Oh, come on. Well, we need you like two. You no want the wheel, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You want the wheel. That's three of eight spins, 32 Come on! Come on, you need Come on! Three times. Let's go. Come on, spin. <laughs> People are bored at home. Oh, that made you think it was a bingo, though. It really wasn't. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, they are up to fifty bucks anyway. Jolie needed this. I did. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Something uh, good. Three seventy-five and back here. <laughs> yeah, it's very poor for three seventy-five and back. You're expecting about at least one fifty to two hundred. Now you go fifty, uh, one fifty. I didn't even get any of the bingo. Boo. Boo boo. What a poor, what a poor bonus. Yeah. I have to say. I have to give the aria props in one area at least. In the men's toilets, we've got dividers between the urinals, so um, you get a bit of pee privacy. 
We all know guys, we like a bit of pee privacy. We don't like the guy at the next urinal, you know, looking down at our wieners. I think you'll all relate. All right, we finally left the area. Heading back to the Flamingo, where we'll do a, a few more bets. And I need food. I'm sure people are sick of me talking about food. But I haven't even eaten anything yet, so. Oh, look at this. Isn't that a lovely tree? That's like the Griswold family Christmas tree, my favourite Christmas movie. I wouldn't fit that in my living room though. Alright, finally getting some to eat. It's going to be an early sandwich. Then any more beer and more slots. Alright, we've jumped on double top dollar. Jolene got confused. We hit max bet. It was ten dollars a spin. So I went, oh shit. Um, so we're on two fifty or three dollars a spin for max bet. Um, and let's give us sixty five. No. Well, yeah, sixty five credits. credits. Twenty five. Cents, but max bet. I say collect it. Okay, right. Yeah, then take then offer. Take, take off. offer. See the what we win. Best place says try again. Never mind that. Take offer. Right. It's 65. We were on 86. See, it wasn't. It was only 32. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, I don't know how this works. So, oh well. It's 3 in the morning and they're still working on the planet Hollywood. <laughs> Someone got the night shift. Okay, we have come to the high limit room in Flamingo. I thought just before we go to bed, let's throw 100 bucks in here, do five bucks a spin because we have a maxed out major of 10 grand. A couple of very small line hits, um, about $10 has been the most. Oh. Come on, <laughs> come on, give us, give us a holding spin. Oh. Oh. Please give us a sweat. I know, I'll give us something. <laughs> mm. That's what it's been, very, very small line hits. Now, this will be interesting. $4.80, five bucks a spin. We're gonna choose Dragon and see if it gives us a winner. Oh, it does, it does. Anything off it? <laughs> mm. Oh, that'll be much. Yeah, we're getting our spin. We're getting our spin. By your fingernails, clutch it in there. <laughs> oh, one more chance. Go, push it, Chris. Oh, another winner. Mm. I feel sorry for us for batting 100 bucks, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, it was sorry worth, our night. worth a try for bad. <laughs> uh, thanks very much, everyone, for watching and following along tonight. Um, but then I'm too much. Yeah, uh, don't, footage, don't yeah. think there's too much content, but um, from tomorrow there'll be proper full yeah, vlogs. Yeah, there'll be a lot more. We only had about three hours in town tonight. Yeah, about four hours, about half three now. So. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, actually. Yeah, so see you tomorrow, guys. Well, here we are. Hello guys, and welcome to a tour of the Go Room here at the Flamingo. So this is just one up from their standard room. Um, and first impressions, we couldn't get the lights to work. Um, the switch by the door doesn't work, so. Yeah, let's take you and show you a bit closer. Okay, so here's a little tour of the room. Got your probably full leather headboard. Sofa. Yeah. Which has seen better days. But yeah, who cares? No one uses stuff anyway. Um, as Jolene said, the the lights not working as we walked in. So this switch here, 
isn't doing anything. No. So we'll have to come in and then just turn on the lights at the wall here. That's not a big issue. It's not a big issue. We'll just phone down and get mm -hmm. that fixed. Um, the lamp in the corner isn't working either. So, yeah. So it's got definitely seen better days, this room, I would say. It has, yeah. Uh, the TV works. Yeah. Yeah. It's not a massive TV, but for all the TV you watch in Vegas. What I do love about this room, though, is there is lots of counter space. So there's lots of space here for all my proc. I can sit and, like, do makeup and things over here. Yeah. Do it straight in my hair. It's just no mirror. It would be good if there was a, a mirror on that yeah, wall instead. Yeah, so it's, it's on this wall instead of that wall. Yeah, but this is yeah. good to, like, check your fit before you go out. Of course. <laughs> You've got a couple of drawers. No fridge. No, no fridge. Why no fridge? It's Caesars. Well, they said if you upgraded one more, which they were looking 30, 30 pounds, pounds a night for. Night. Yeah. Um, which, when you're here a week, we didn't think was really worth it. No. Um, this is your wardrobe. Oh, somebody's left their bags. <laughs> yeah. Um, see ya. See ya. It's a bit high up for you, tiny TV. It is, yeah. I need the yellow pages to stand on that. <laughs> But uh, this got an iron board and an iron, of course. Is probably yeah. This is this room's best feature. Yeah, this is a. I'm surprised, but there you've got the drapes and shear controls here. Yeah. We have the flamingo lamp here. The air conditioning controls here, and the room is nice and cool. Anyone interested, um, the temperature goes down to 65 degrees Fahrenheit, which is 18.33 in Celsius. And coming into the bathroom, we have the shower cubicle, separate to the typical Caesars bathtub. It's always great having a bathtub, isn't it? Having a nice soak. Just have your toilet and your single sink as well. So yeah, basic. You've got like a a sliding door with frosted glass, you know, that's what it is. But I would definitely say the best part about it, this room is the view. So you've got the sphere. And I think this is where the chaise lounge, is that how you say it? Chaise lounge. <laughs> um, it comes into its own because I could just see myself sitting there with a wee coffee. Yeah. Watching that. But yeah, the view is very, very good. Yeah, I'm happy with that because we haven't seen this sphere since no. it started running shows. So yeah. Yeah, not a strip view, but that, honestly, that's every bit as good to me. Not having seen the sphere before, so yeah. Yeah, the room ups and downs. Okay, so that's a room tour. So thanks everyone for following along tonight if you've made it this far. Yeah. And glad to be back in Vegas. Yes. See you all tomorrow. Absolutely. See you guys soon.